It's about time. Been waiting for your call. They caused a hell of a mess in Moscow. Was it worth it? Adler managed to get the list of sleeper agent names, despite himself. He's got balls, I'll give him that. Bell did well. Seemingly. But I think that team is getting too comfortable. They're acting like they know who they're dealing with. Perhaps. Turns out, one of those sleeper agents is tied to Operation Greenlight. Theodore Hastings. He's a nuclear engineer based out of Salt Lake City. And you believe Hastings is the one he'll activate? Exactly. Total surveillance is already underway. It's only a matter of time before he leads us straight to Perseus. Man, I'm having so much fun with this campaign. It's good, man. This is it. The recent movements of Theodore Hastings has led us here. Cuba. Right in our backyard. A vacant government facility in the Cuban countryside has become a hub of activity for Perseus, and the likely location of the stolen nuke. No doubt Castro allowed it. Twenty bucks to anyone who can bring him down before me. Who? Castro or Perseus? Whoever. We are not gonna let him move this nuke inside the states. It's time to take down Perseus, once and for all. Team, wrap up any unfinished business. Once we strike, there's no turning back. Woods, don't get any bright ideas over there. Yeah, you've got my sure as shit. Once again, if you guys want to go ahead and pause, look at the evidence for yourselves, I'm just going to skim through it. You guys are more willing to do so. We're just going to continue on and start the mission. Yo. I believe we're in the Hastings left Salt Lake City. We tracked his movements all the way to Cuba. We have to assume Perseus moved the nuke there. If you guys Langley are enjoying the stream, man, go ahead and push that follow button to the US. In exchange for a peek at the hardware, of course. I would greatly appreciate the love. Well, What's I do plan? appreciate the, the love and support that you guys are showing. The last read we have on came from 30 miles south of Havana. We suspect Perseus is, is using an abandoned the compound there to hold the so nuke. Far. They're working under the radar, Let's so keep expect it up, man. moderate security. I say we smash and grab. Parachute in, grab the nuke, skyhook out. And what if the nuke isn't there? It's there. The only reason Perseus needs Hastings in Cuba is to prepare it for arming and detonation. There you have it. Hudson will arrange our exfil while we're en route. If everyone's ready, let's move out. Adler's late. No, love, we're early. Adler should be checking in right about... Spark, we're in position. Copy that. We're moving to flank. All teams, we do this fast and loud. Find Hastings, grab the nuke, get the hell out. Woods, light up this joint. It's about fucking time. Go, go, go! I need cover. Do the honors, Bell.
What did these poor bastards do? They finished their job. They love a reward. They've got closed circuit cameras. We could use them to locate the nuclear bomb. Sharp as ever. Is everyone all right? Bell, sweep the mines. Mason, you missed one behind the counter. Thanks, Park. Push, Push up. up. Keep looking. There. Hold it. Adler, we have eyes on the nuclear device. Bloody hell. Someone's killing the scientists. Second floor, room 27B. Second floor, center room. Upstairs. Let's move. Mark. Crude, but effective. Can't keep your eyes off me, huh, Park? Bell, use the C4. Hey, yo, and we just hit 900 subs on YouTube. Thank you guys so much for your support, y'all. That Adler, is amazing.
Oh, did y'all see that? I am so stupid. Wow, he got in my way, cuz. Dog. That was the biggest fail. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I did not mean to do that. That's our man the door. Got it. <laughs> Bell canvas the room. Hastings, stop talking. <gasps> Perseus was here. <coughs> he shot us. He escaped. Perseus would never leave his precious nuke behind. Wants us to reverse engineer the detonation codes. They give him full access to green light. What? Are you telling me Perseus can detonate multiple nukes in Europe? I'm so sorry. Hastings, stay with us. How many green light devices can Perseus detonate with those codes? He can detonate all of them. He'll wipe out half of Europe. Blame it all on the USA. We need to find that son of a bitch, Perseus. Time to go. No? Contact. Chopper coming in low. It's gotta be Perseus. All teams head to the roof. Move! Move! And so we get a shit ton of reinforcements circling the top. Let's go! Moving! Damn it, Doors. Clear! Out of the way! Adler, I got eyes on an HVT. Down from top. Could be Perseus. He's climbing into a chopper. Lock it down. Out the window. Out the window. Bell, the window. Go. Fuck me. The chopper got away. Fuck the chopper. We got bigger problems. Hello. Hog down. Don't wait for us. Prep for Skyhawk. This is ground team. Bring you a visual. Roger that ground team. We have visual. Fasten your harness, cross your arms, and remember to keep your backs to the wind. Inbound in two minutes. Heads up, Fire. You got snipers on the roof. Copy that. Bell, take out those Duck. snipers. That plane. One minute. Stay focused, Lazar. When we get out of this, I'm buying. Now that's something worth fighting. Green team, this is Skyhook. The zone is hot as hell. Lend an assist. That will be much appreciated, Skyhook. We only got enough fuel for one more. 
Copy that, Skyhook. I can see the plane. Park, we need to hook into the line now. We'll do it in turns. Bell, you harness up first. We'll cover. Go! We don't have much time. They making me choose. No. No. Lazar, I'm so sorry, man. I'm so sorry, Lazar. Well, that was a goddamn fiasco. You go in with the intel you have. Dang, not the intel man. You he want. Was the... We paid the fucking piper down there. You think this Why did you have to make me choose? I don't know whose fault it is. Why? I just know that Perseus doesn't have a single fucking nuke. He's got dozens. Millions of people are gonna die, and the United States will take the blame. You need to find out where he's planning to broadcast the activation signal. How are we gonna pull that out of our ass? Bell knows where it is. Bell? This goddamn science project was a failure! Don't count Adler out yet. The man has a deep bag of tricks. Come on, a little further. Sims, get the gurney. We're going to lose a lot more than Lazar if we don't execute this next move correctly. We need you to hang in there for one more assignment. I'm counting on you again, Bell. Sims, get the dosages ready. All of them. Adler, stop wasting our valuable time. He's of no use to us anymore. Stay alert, Bell. You're the key to stopping persons. You always have been. No more half-assing it. We're doing an interest of cerebral injection. Injecting directly into the brain could provoke seizures, or worse. Damn, with the eye socket. You sure about this, Doc? The memory should begin almost immediately. Bell, listen to me. I need you to remember. Think back to our time in Vietnam one more time. We need to finish what we started. We had a job to do. Think, Bell. Perseus. Do you remember coming face to face with Perseus in Vietnam? Dude. EKG Did he stick me in an eye? Shit. Heart rate's off the charts. I need you to relax and focus, Bell. Your helicopter crashed. You made your way through the jungle, alone. You found a bunker. Do you remember the bunker, Bell? We need to know what's inside that bunker. Do not trust Adler. Adler is lying to you. Do not trust him. Do not listen to Adler. He is lying to you. He is lying to you. Do not trust Adler. 
During a mission to investigate reports of a Soviet bunker, your chopper was hit by ground fire. According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a firefight. The crash survivors were defending against a VC attack. You ran forward and picked up an M16. Then you realized you were the sole survivor. You set off to locate the bunker. The path split near a ruin, so you took the right fork, not the trail to the left. Russian voices from a cave across the river, so you went to investigate. You equipped your shotgun and had a bow. That's when you discovered VC soldiers meeting with Soviet agents. Зачем 
Yes, Bell. That was the door into the Soviet bunker. Yes, good, the bunker. Now tell me about Perseus. Ah, we almost had it. Let's run six. Okay, ready. Bell, we've got a job to do. According to your debrief, you woke up and the rest of your crew was missing. The VC were on the ground searching for survivors. You readied your bow to take them out silently. Path split near a ruin, so you took the well-traveled trail on your left, not toward the waterfall on the right. Ah! 
You mentioned crossing a bridge near a village. I want to go somewhere on the other side. At the fork, you followed the road right toward the sound of gunfire. Seeing a firefight, you readied your M16. He stored up a hornet's nest. Need chopper support, eh? Roger that. Chopper inbound. ETA two minutes. But it got messed up. Yes, this was the bunker entrance you described in the report. This could be the onset of another focal seizure. I think I know what to do. I know what to do. Wow. That's creepy. This is so creepy. Stop, Bell. Fuck, fuck. Hand me the fallback scenario manual. Here it is. Bell, we've got a job to do. According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a firefight. Crash survivors were defending against a VC attack. You readied a grenade launcher and charged ahead. Ooh. Ooh. I 
I won't get this mission, though. That's what I want. split near a ruin so you took the well-traveled trail on your left not toward the waterfall on the right now oh, this is great that man dangling on the string. <laughs> were pinned down on a ridge. You readied your sniper rifle to assist. I don't care if the door was fucking stuck. Open it. Whoa. Dude. <laughs> Yo. This is insane. What the hell is going on? Give Bell another injection. 
That could be lethal. Bell's heart rate is Do it high. now. Yeah. Heart rate is spiking. I don't know what I'm not said. sure how much longer Bell can last. I really don't know. Whoa. This is insane. Just get me the hell out of here, please. Okay, so we got doors closing by themselves, okay. you average yo dog you on that stuff man right now stop speaking in circles Wait. stop wasting my time with this hallway okay so turn around <laughs> Man, they playing mind games. What the lab? What the hell is Bell doing in the lab? Bell, forget about the damn lab. I need to know about the bunker. Comrades, the United States and its allies slowly consume you. survive another round now you're asking me do it we're not leaving empty-handed script 17 ready bell you've got a job to do 
Come on, dude. We've been over this already. Skip ahead to the next one. Okay, we skipped. Good. The bunker door was right there at the ruins, Bell. You went in. Bell, go into the bunker now. United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. Our leaders continue to weaken under this threat. It is the moral duty of Perseus to act when they will not. Soon we will possess an American nuclear bomb. The key to unlocking their entire green light arsenal. Once we control the green light arsenal, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovetsky. You gotta admit, I'm surprised. About. Didn't Damn. think they'd recover so fast. We tried everything. Normal forms of interrogation weren't working. Breaking a subject's will and erasing their mind is a difficult and painful process. That's a small price to pay. The CIA's mind control program has had a great deal of success with the over it's control of my mind. You want me to tell them about my time in Vietnam? Lastly, you'll need a command phrase to trigger the implanted memories. We have a job to do. We have a job to do. We have a job to do. You had to reach the Soviet bunker. It appears the subject's programming is beginning to take hold. We've got a job to do. We've known each other for years. Fought together, bled together, been through the hell of Vietnam together. We've got a job to do. And now the training's complete. We just need to give the subject a name. Bell. Wow. This is... Wow. They did this to me. And here I thought we were cool, y'all. What the hell? Here I am thinking we cool, bro. Like, for real? coming too. Bell, no more fucking around. What did Perseus say? Where is he? You're disoriented, Bell. We'll explain everything later. Right now, we need to help each other. No, I don't know, man. Ooh, I, I want to go this route now. Bullshit is what your whole life will amount to if you don't come clean. Tell us where Perseus is. Where is Perseus? You tell us, Bell. That's what this whole fucking thing is about. Bell, you were one of Perseus's agents. His associate, Arash Kardavar, turned on you at the airstrip in Turkey. Left you for dead. Traps on his stopping in Duma. This you know. Here's what you don't know. Perseus won't be there. None of these hired guns are going to leave Duba alive. We'll dump their bodies in the forest. Then we will move the weapons to Volkov in Berlin. From 
there, we fly to Solopetsky. But I have other plans for you. Perseus thinks too highly of you. I don't want the competition. Damn! Oh, wow. We were there. We found you after everything went down. The CIA reinvented you, Val. We needed to give you a new identity to replace the old one. Sims and I both wanted you to be CIA. You didn't resist it as much as we thought you might. And we were able to utilize your language and cryptography skills as an added bonus. The bigger challenge was your memory. The CIA's MK Ultra program used Atlas missions in Vietnam as a template. We needed you to have that shared experience, that lifelong bond, to establish trust. yourself lucky you've only had those memories for a few months me I've been living with them for over a decade interrogation didn't work with you but thanks to MK Ultra's research we had a backup plan if you believed you were someone else we could lead you to a place where you'd give everything up enough to get us where we are today but we're not finished yet We have a job to do. Bell, we've got a job to do. We've got a job to do. We've got a job to do. The trigger phrase kept you in line, but it didn't get us everything we needed. Your innermost secrets were always locked behind a door. I see that. Bell, I realize you probably hate us right now. What we've done to you. I just need you to fully understand the stakes here. What you do right now is not about me, it's not about you, it's about millions of other fucking people. It's about stopping someone who in the end has no true allegiance to anyone other than himself. So tell me, where is Perseus? Once we control the green stars, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovets. From the safety of Solovets. Solovets. This is your chance to find out who you really are, Val. Where is Perseus? From the safety of Solovetsky. 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 Sims, get Washington on the line. Everyone else gear up. We're leaving now. You made the right choice, Bell. Come on. You're still one of us. Okay, yeah, it's messed up what you did, but at the same time. And they did save my life. Perseus. The CIA's analysts consider him so... to be the single largest threat to the free world. You've been given an important task. Protecting our very way of life from a great evil. The United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. We are hours away from Perseus detonating nuclear bombs in every major European city. We'll do whatever it takes. Some of us have crossed the line to make sure the line's still there in the morning. Man, this is intense. No one's gonna brand us heroes or villains. They don't know us. As for me, I've been chasing this ghost for 13 years. Let's get him, boys! That ends now.
Perseus, you going into the grinder. Ha <laughs> ha. Let's get him. when I tell you, Hudson. Oh, he's the one with that helmet on. Oh, 
Is the helmet? Got him. I hate those dudes. Oh, my bad. They did it, Mr. President. They stopped the nukes. Thank God. And the CIA. Did they get Perseus? No, sir. His whereabouts are unknown. And a Russian response? Nothing yet. We're seeing signs of confusion. It's possible this was all a rogue operation. Perseus may not have been following orders from Moscow. Well, I'll be damned. Maybe we have something in common after all. My hand, Bell. We did it. This is a message to Perseus and those that'll follow him. We don't just sit back and hope for the best. We'll make the best happen. This is how wars are won, Bell. Okay, I get you. I get you. Do you have an update on Kasim Javadi? Yeah. After capturing Kasim Javadi, we've convinced him he's better off working for us rather than against us. The death of Arash Kadavar opens a path for Kasim to take control of their network. He'll give us deeper insight into Soviet activity in the Middle East. And with our resources behind him, he should be able to influence regional affairs for years to come. What about Anton Volkov? After his death, 
Elements inside the GDR saw an opportunity to reduce the Russian mob's influence in East Berlin. Two days ago, in a large-scale midnight raid, Stasi swept through the homes of anyone with connections to Volkov. Men, women, and children were all gone before the sun rose. This will be a major setback to underground Soviet activity in Europe. How did the cleanup in Havana go? We were able to recover Agent Azalei's body from the compound in Cuba. President Reagan personally reached out to his family and his caskets in transit to Tel Aviv. As you know, Helen Park returned to London. She'll continue to recover from her injuries there. Afterwards, MI6 plans to give her a task force dedicated to finding Perseus. What about the rest of the team? They got off Solovetsky before the Soviets could send in forces to investigate. We'll take some time to heal up, then it's back to work. We may have stopped Perseus, but his rats are still nesting all around us, thanks to the help of one of our own. True. We failed to hunt down Robert Aldrich and his domestic network of spies. We may have to go to more extreme measures, like broad domestic surveillance, which of course we're not authorized to do. Not yet. What about Europe? We may have saved it from getting blown to Kingdom Come, but it's still stacked with Perseus's agents. There's more we could have done there if we'd had the time. Hmm. There was still all these loose ends. And Bell. Arctic air. There's the head, doesn't it? Bell, you made two extraordinary sacrifices to stop Perseus. One was without your knowledge. The other, you made that decision of your own accord. I just want you to know that this little thing that's happened with you and me, it was always for the greater good. You're a goddamn hero, you know that kid. Heroes have to make sacrifices. That's why when I ask you for one more, I hope you understand. It was never personal. Oh, whoa. Whoa. What the heck happened? Wow. <laughs> Did we both shoot each other? Bro. Oh, 